that's what the colonial monarchy did. It removed our language, it removed our culture, displaced us off the land. This is the traditional and unceded territory of the Musqueam, Squamish and Tsleil-Waututh nations. And it's where we're hearing both condolences and a call to the new monarch to reject a doctrine used to justify the colonization of this land. And these BC Indigenous leaders are not alone in seeing this brutal legacy tied to the crown. The BC Union of Indian Chiefs wants King Charles III's first official act to be renouncing the doctrine of discovery, a 15th century Catholic Church framework described in this documentary as a proclamation that triggered a free-for-all of European conquest. The English possessions in America were not claimed by right of conquest, but by right of discovery. Chief Judy Wilson says renouncing the doctrine during this change of head of state would also show a change in the Crown's approach to Indigenous sovereignty. And he also has a lot of uh, obligation and responsibility toward restoring our language and our culture and also most of all land back uh, because that's where we were displaced from uh, or dispossessed by the Crown on annex annexing our land. UBC professor Handel Cachope Wright says he gets why Sierra Leoneans like him have mixed feelings about the Queen's death. He says the British participated in the slave trade, later abolished it and established the Freetown colony for formerly enslaved peoples. Then he says they spent decades stripping the country of diamonds, iron ore and other resources. I think we can be sad at the passing of a, of a matriarch, but at the same time, I don't think people ought to be obligated to feel that way. And I don't think that we should shut down the idea of people expressing their opinions also about um, what was and what still are the remnants of um, what was awful about colonization. Apologies, no! With calls about cutting ties with the monarchy growing louder in some countries, there are challenges for the king ahead. He's, he's been able to connect with so many folks um, and uh, I think he's prepared well for this role, So, uh, although it may take some time. Chief Wilson hopes the king plans to come to Turtle Island soon to meet with Indigenous peoples. I don't want him coming to Canada and just doing photo ops and, you know, uh, saying some nice words. We've heard them before. We need some action. In Vancouver, Crystal Adair. City News.